What's up guys, this is Torkar and I'm back with another costume review and in this review um, I will show you my last of the three uh, custom Vaki and in this case this is a uh, yeah, kind of Titan Vaki actually um, using uh, very similar legs to those that I used in my Makuta Koyo actually just a um, slight recolor and a little more stable than on the Makuta Koyo. Um, yeah, pretty similar with the with the tubes that um, most of the Titans use, so nothing too special on there. Uh, yeah, the torso is uh, completely custom. Um, also, the base that I started off was uh, the Vaki neck and somewhere in there is the Hordica back part. Also I used uh, two black Hordica, uh, no, uh, Vaki neck parts as the shoulders, which works out pretty nice. And then um, I had to fill in the gaps on the sides from the torso to the shoulders, uh, which worked out all right, I think. Um, gave me the possibility to add more silver in there. I used this, uh, I think, some some uh, 2009 Bionica set. I have no, uh, uh, I don't know what the name of the set was. Had those pieces as shoulder parts, but I used it as a uh, torso part right there. And then a metro chest piece, uh, just to add some more silver in there. And um, yeah, these these parts on the sides are still pretty gappy. Um, I think I can fix that with adding just adding some system stuff in there. You know, some system plates. Um, but I'm still not sure if I really should do that. Uh, so yeah, I'm I'm really not too sure about this. Um, but I'll definitely find a solution. Then uh, just some more add-on to give this uh, to give this torso more uh, of a structure. Used a slicer, yeah, kind of. These are slicer heads, right? I don't know what what body part is it? Is it the head? Because it had uh, added on the visors on there. Um, I assume it's the head. Yeah. Um, this is not actually a. Vaki revamp really uh, just a custom Vaki because I'm um, I'm also using bigger tools uh, which are on the one end these uh, Brutaka swords and on the other hand this this piece uh, I think we got three of those in the uh, Tahu Mystica set I'm not too sure but I think I got him from there yeah, just the, the lower arm is not really uh, custom, just the piraka leg and the uh, upper arm. I used some Borok head pieces for that and uh, two Nuva chest plates on both of the arms. Um, yeah, and the head is... Uh, um, I struggle a bit with the head because there's not really a possibility to uh, make it bigger uh, with um, keeping the general structure um, so I just added on a few pieces on there which are uh, for one part on the front the um, yeah the sting part or the uh, yeah the leg part that came with um, Lord of Skull Spiders and then one of the Pohatic Claws and one silver Visorak foot Yeah, and that's it for this uh, normal You know normal form um, He can transform But he is a little unstable due to his weight uh, I'd have to uh, Restructure the arms a bit to make him more stable mm. But I didn't really do that yet uh, I pushed the camera, I think. Gotta bring down the legs. 
to this point. And yeah, he's, he's uh, still kind of able to uh, stand up. I mean, it works, but it only works if he's standing on all four, uh, on all four legs or two legs and the uh, two tools. Uh, otherwise, he would fall over. So, if I uh, if I try to pose him in the way uh, that brings his tool down like this, as it was shown in some of the Vaki uh, commercials, I think. No, it doesn't work anymore. So I have to keep him like this. Sucks a little, but um, at least it works in this position. So, yeah. Also, this is... Uh, I'm, I'm rather focusing on the legs when building a titan so the legs really should carry the weight but the arms just carry their own weight actually and are not uh, meant to carry the weight of the whole mock or the half of the mock right here uh, so yeah that's it for this uh, Vaki please tell me what you think in the comments uh, I'm really curious because I've gotten some positive feedback for the Svaki, but not only, and I really would like to know what I could do better. Um, uh, maybe about the upper arms, uh, I'm not 100% happy with those. Or about the torso, since it's a little gappy, maybe you know uh, some technique that I could use. And I'll still search for uh, better black armor parts or Technic parts actually to fill up those gaps. Maybe I'll just have to buy some uh, Technic stuff to get this done. And yeah, um, as I said, that's it. Nothing more to say other than uh, goodbye and maybe I'll see you in the next video.